Hi, introductions are stupid. I'm not here to waste your time. So let's just get into it, please. Ooh, too much light. We all remember seventh grade, also known as the worst, worst thing ever of our lives. But there was one highlight, which is not true. This wasn't a highlight. One thing we all remember, the iconic It's Friday, Friday, gotta get Now some of you may know and some of you may not know yet but are about to because I'm gonna tell you. Friday by Rebecca Black was created by either out of touch or completely evil people who worked at a company called Arc Music Factory, which has been dubbed by viewers as auto-tuned rich kids, which is just a very appropriate and perfect way to interpret that acronym. I'm sure that's not what it actually meant, but that it, it, that's what it is. So if you thought that Rebecca Black's Friday could not possibly get any worse, you're correct. But if you thought it was the worst of the worst, <laughs> I got, I got some bad news for you. They have other songs. Are they just as bad? No. They're worse. They saw the ironic success of Friday and they thought, you know what? Let's keep this going, right? I mean, I think this music is good, I, right? No, it's not. So their actual channel name is Trizzy66. Might wanna add another six at the end of that because this is for sure run by the devil, but it's this guy. Oh, I'm excited. We already know Friday, so we're gonna skip that and go to some other ones. Abby Victor, crush on you, which is the worst name I've heard in a while. Other than Louise Nordoff, who ironically was a better singer than this girl, I assume. I, are you sure? It's a pretty intense tune. I'd like to sing it now, please. Let's go ahead and get to it. Uh, 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 arc. They also self-promote a lot, like their DJ Khaled. Uh, 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 arc. Jason Derulo. Young Money. Young Moolah, baby. Saturday, Saturday night. Night. Okay, so clearly the songwriters had some weird obsession with Days of, Days the, of week. the Week. Don't get me wrong, I'm all for making music that's based on real life, but when it's something as trivial and mundane as- A day of the week? Were they in the studio just like- Okay, what is relatable? All right, what do, what do kids know? What are they What are they thinking about? What are they experiencing? Bullying? No, that's too touchy and where we can't, I don't know. We'd have to like write meaningful things. I don't, I don't, I don't have time for that. I have to finish signing these divorce papers. Ha, Paul, we could write about children of divorce. Uh, that's relatable. Uh. Too soon, Jonathan. Way too soon. Sorry, I guess. Okay, what about, I don't know, school? Uh, teachers? Homework? No. What about, uh, friendship? No. Being lost? Trying to find their identity? Feeling left out? No. What more is there- What, what do you want me to do? Fucking days of the week? Yes. Yes, that's- Perfect. No, it's not. Yes, it is. It's I oh. Come on guys get writing. This is this is gold. No, it's no, not. What, what, what? We're gonna write about Look. hating Mondays. Look if it works for the cure Who's to say it won't work for us? Yeah, but we're not the cure. We're arc music factory We're awful But are we Steven are we awful though are we really? They're trying to just relate to the lowest common denominator. I mean, everyone knows days of the week, probably. What? That sounds familiar. Look, I'm all for being eco-friendly, but how much do you have to recycle the same lyrics before you realize, uh, they're not good. They're very bad. I'm watching, I'm watching you go. about it is bad. Every element, like no part of it makes it redeeming. Production is bad. Writing is bad. The instrumentation is bad. The singing is bad. Nothing can make this sound good. The one thing that could make it sound good is changing every single part of it and deleting it and making an entirely different song. Okay. This is a key point I want to bring up. The original writers who, who make the lyrics don't speak English, so they have to translate it into English. But 
they don't translate it perfectly, which winds up with hilarious mistakes like this. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed this. What should I, how do I get me noticed? What should I, how do I get me noticed? Like, there's something just a little off. It's not only repeating herself, but it's also kind of interrupting herself. What should I, how do I get me noticed? Also, get me noticed. Just the error of... <laughs> how do I get me noticed? <laughs> That's one thing you're gonna notice amongst these songs. So far, this is the most promising because this is a tropical little beat. And so far, they haven't said Arc Music Factory, so it's a good sign. I've changed my mind. I know this might be the least important thing to criticize, but this looks like a really low quality limited to commercial. Everyone is wearing something that I think I owned when I was 12 years old. Ooh, I know the way you got me thinking, boy. Again, another wild mistranslation. That made no sense. I know the way you got me thinking, boy. I know the way you got me thinking, boy. Something's a little bit off. I know the way you're calling me on my phone each day telling me now. First of all, who casted these people? This is the most awkward 14 year old kid I've ever seen more awkward than any 14 year old awkward kid I knew in real life in middle school. But like, we all kind of knew a guy like this, right? He might be hot now. He's not, I just know it though. The way you're calling me on my phone each day telling me now. Calling me on my phone each day, n telling me each day now. It's just like a horrible sentence structure. Wanna take it, take it easy. Cause I don't wanna rush this. No, I don't wanna rush this. So take it easy, let's take it easy. pattern of theirs, nauseating repetition. Would this sound good if the singing was good? <clears throat> I'm kind of a good singer, so I'll give it a shot. Let's take it easy. Well, I don't know what to tell you <laughs> other than no. 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 no, 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 no. There's your answer right there. Cause I don't wanna rush this, I don't wanna rush this, no, no, no. We've pretty much got the gist of the song. She would really like to take it easy and not rush this. Not rush this, not rush this, no, 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 no. No. Next one, Butterflies by Alana Lee. Yeah, arc. Uh, 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 arc. They're like, we're very proud of what we've made. So let us remind you that it is in fact us. Don't get it twisted, we made this. Don't give anyone else credit other than us because this is great. No, it's not. Quick disclaimer, Alana Lee has made other music since this. She's actually really great. <laughs> I'd love to see where these people are now. What jobs do they have? And when their bosses do a background check, I mean, they're f What it is, what is it? What should I, how do I get me no Where does this leave them? From the early days, I saw your face, boy. No lie. <laughs> Just with the way that was going, I thought she was gonna say, I saw your Facebook. Oh. I saw your Facebook. Added you as a friend, then followed you on Instagram. Told me a lie. I knew you were shy. Remember when you were in elementary school and you hadn't yet learned what a run on sentence is? So you would just put ands everywhere or like commas? 7 a.m. waking up in the morning. Gotta be Go Instead of saying, you walk me home from school holding my hand, you would say, you walked me home from school and you held my hand while walking me home from school holding my hand. Home from school. That's the side effect of the language barrier. I get lost sometimes when you like a fool. These sentences are so weird. Sometimes one part of a sentence, the second part will completely be something out of left field. You ignore my words and I can't get over you. 
You hold my hand under a tree, and also the sky is blue, but sometimes black at night after the sun sets. Also lakes have water, and my mom has self-diagnosed arthritis. Where did you go? Where did these come from? How did your conversation steer in this direction? Oh, that's a lot of things you just said. Uh, the last one's not good to hear, but um, I don't remember asking. And I, I feel like we were talking about something totally and completely different. Actually, I don't remember coming up and talking to you at all. You just kind of started singing. So I'm gonna go be not here. How do I get me your hair and eyes but my dad's an alcoholic i don't see how that stops us from being together or what that has to do with you liking my hair and eyes does that does that prevent you from fully liking my hair and eyes the fact that your dad never stops drinking there's so many examples i can make out of this i got this you got this my friend is by my right I put notes in your locker but you're wearing shoes on your feet with socks underneath oh i got a rhyme I got a fucking rhyme. Awesome. Awesome. The way you got me feeling today. Oh, I don't know. You cry and sobbing your eyes off. I like sitting next to you and water bottles are plastic usually unless they're not. So take it easy, let's say <laughs> absolutely nonsensical. Another thing, they'll repeat the same thing just in different ways. So let's take it easy. I have no siblings, and also I'm an only child, but I also have no sister and brother, or any siblings at all. I gotta keep this to myself, nobody got to know, I gotta keep this quiet, leave this a secret. I have a bedroom, and a bed, and also I live in a house. Yeah, those two things typically go hand in hand. It's kind of a given, but um, nice to know you understand the definition of things, I guess. So just the most basic, outdated, overused cliches. Humanly possible. Presented in a very, very bizarre way. It's fucking bizarre. You give me butterflies. So bad. Not even so bad it's good. This is so bad. That it's bad. Like, it's bad. And bad. It's almost, it's almost unreal, unreal how bad how this bad is. Bad. Who? There were so many different people on the team who made this, and all of them were just like, Okay, I guess we're just gonna ruin this girl's life, I suppose. Let's go, dude, I need a paycheck. How did they sit there with their headphones on, with the amount of checks they had to do and takes they had to take and the process of making this, you have to hear it multiple times. How did their ears just not explode? After like five listens straight, putting it together, I'd be like, I, I can't go on. I have to divorce my wife tomorrow because of this fucking horrible song. I would have to listen to the 1975 and Harry Styles for just to cleanse myself of this abomination. Awful. Oh, so bad. I remember this one. It's one of my favorite, least favorites. Another pattern I noticed. They really love using a synthesizer. It's that zzz. You know what a B sounds like? Zzz. Like when it goes across your ear? People in the music industry heard that and thought, what if that was an instrument? It took years for people to realize, hey, this sounds like a housefly having diarrhea. She's a kind of girl. She gives me. Sometimes 
I do understand suicide. You cannot listen to this ironically. You can listen to this when you realize you ate something that's gonna make you sick and you need to vomit. Had its own, like, second hell, even deeper underground. Here's your sound check right here. I found it, but like maybe not because I think I think even Satan couldn't withstand this. Oh my God, turn that off, please, please, just play the Big Bang Theory, please. I think that's my threshold. Then God is like, sorry guys, sorry, I, don't, I don't know how that one slipped out. I I, I, I make mistakes. I'm not, I'm not perfect. perfect. I know you guys keep telling me I am, but but clearly I'm not. I'm not. I can't apologize enough. I'm also sorry for these things as well. So super sorry. Just remember. I did still make Beyonce and Harry Styles. I did still make them. So, sorry, but also you're welcome. I don't believe in God. And this song reminds me how much I don't. And if he is real, I have some fucking complaints. There had to have been at least one person, one person working on this song who looked at people and said, Hear me out, guys. Hear me out. Hear me out. But this might be terrible. I, it's just a feeling, could be way off base here, but I think I'm not off base at all. John, get the f out of here. I need, I need a paycheck. I don't care if it's bad. The Big Bang Theory is still on television. Maroon 5 is still making music. Sometimes things have to be bad, so we appreciate things that are good. I think Gandhi said that, I'm pretty sure. Not true at all. Baby still exists. Yeah, but I, I think this is worse. I think this might be worse. Mm. And even if it is, it is. That's okay. Sometimes places gotta blow up. That's not true at Sometimes all. Sometimes bombs need to go off. I don't know, dude. No, they don't. I don't know what to tell you. You're literally horrible. So I think you've seen enough. I will stop now and not subject you to any more because I really don't want to be responsible for someone's nausea. I apologize. This should have never been created. It is an absolute disservice to the entire earth. It is disrespectful to music. These songs should not exist. So let's make one of our own. I've got GarageBand pulled up and my MIDI ready to go. More like Midi Werben Jägerman Jensen, my right. <laughs> uh, sorry. So let's look at our criteria. We need improper word usage and, your eyes off. and vague grammatical and syntactic errors. What it is, what is it? Describe basic things that are happening around you. 7 a.m. waking up in the morning. Very trivial observations. When you walk in. Or like mundane locations. And activities. Gotta have my bowl, gotta have cereal. Lyrics that are loosely related but also kind of irrelevant. I can't even focus with my friends. Jumping from line to line with very poor transition. Gotta be fresh, gotta go downstairs. Middle school subject matter. You give me butterflies deep inside. Most basic lyrical cliches of all fing time. So Nonsensical lyrics with no coherence. Nauseating repetition. Random, awkward, erroneous melodies. Overall, lack of confidence in vocal delivery. The lyrical patterns are just loosely thrown together, and then the writers are like, Should we do some revisions as far as like her delivery, her cadence? Um, I mean, like, I gotta get going, so. I think no, I don't. I think I think this is pretty important. Um, no, it seems kind of necessary. Maybe I could be way off base here, but I don't think uh, that I am. I think no. So, want Chinese food? I hate all of this, but yes. The back of sex, such a good feeling. I'm more comfortable now. Let me go back and listen to Hooked on You and get more inspiration. 
You know what this sounds like? Imagine if Christian music wasn't Christian and instead was worse. Or like Kids Bop. Kids Bop walked so Ark Music Factory could run. God, that's so true. It's like if Kids Bop tried to be original but the writers couldn't speak English. Never let a language barrier stand in your way from making horrible, terrible music. I'm worried about the singing part because I just don't want to sing bad. Let me remind myself how bad they sing. Everybody tells me to leave you alone. alone. This sounds like it should have been like a dub and not real singing. Like one of those worst performance ever. The way that I've been holding on to time. The story of my life, I think. Let me go ahead and try to sing that bad. Oh, right, I have to write the lyrics. <laughs> what should it be about? I, I know it's low-hanging fruit, but I think I'm gonna- Guys, I am so sorry about this flyaway hair. I had no idea. I literally want to kill myself watching this right now. I know it's distracting. Please bear with me. I am just so sorry. Write a song about Mondays. Mondays are the worst. Great opener. Right, that's relatable. I drive all night. Repetition, Mondays are the worst, worst, worst. Days of the week, they are the first, first, first. First is the worst, second is the best. And since we did a little sing-songy melody from childhood, Let's continue on that track. Ring around the rosy and roses are red. Which reminds me, this should be a love song. I think that's what I'm gonna do, right? Let's make it into a love song about Mondays somehow. I'll make it work, I'll make it work. Let's make an awkward sentence that jump from line to line with poor structure. You text me on your cell phone. Oh, 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 simple observations. Keyboard in your hands. Well, something that sounds like it was poorly translated. I hear it ring inside my pocket when I look at the screen. See how it, it needs punctuation. I hear it ring. It's just like jumping from one thing to the other with no, no transition, no flow. Time for the hook. Time for that sweet, sweet hook. Love song. Hate most all Mondays until Ew. I see your face. Nailed it, nailed it, nailed it. <gasps> heart beats so fast. Wait, my heart goes so fast. Yes. Sounds so much more off and bizarre. Ah! Time to sing it. Can't wait. The final step. Mondays are the worst, worst, worst. I'm trying to think of a melody, but then I realize it's supposed to like have a bad one. Days of week, they Not even gonna do a second take because it's supposed to be bad. I might do a second take. This is painful to create. I, 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 uh. Hey, Finny. The girl's body, the butt, the shape, it's amazing. All right. Everything I've ever learned, everything I've ever practiced, I just totally flush down the fing drain. Full blast auto tune. Oh my god. I can't even like tell what key it's in. It's just, it's just bad. It's the key of bad. God awful. Three takes is enough. And let's see how it turned out. But I can't give my reaction because I'm gonna work on this and then fing go to sleep. So I'll just pretend that I'm listening to it with you. Yeah. Uh, 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 arc.
terrible. I totally heard it. Anyways, thanks so much for joining your girl, Finn. Uh, I hope I, I hope I made you laugh. Don't subscribe. I want to be an anti-YouTuber. Don't subscribe. I'm terrible. <laughs> It's gonna very much misrepresent my music because I want to make actual music. So this is just, I might essentially be destroying my career before it even begins. But you know, what? you know what? You gotta make sacrifices for comedy, huh, don't ya? Sorry about that stray hair. That's all I have to say and all I can think of, so. Call me Pig Boy because you know I'll be squealing. Join me next time. Or don't. Uh, anything else that I have to say or wanted to say, I don't remember right now. So I guess this is where uh, we part ways. Okay, bye. Two, go ahead. Say, dude, say, dude, a fucking minute, okay?